way to Great Wolf Lodge for Clamor. We're so excited. Let's go! Woo! We have a problem. A big problem. They basically said we have been driving by a miracle. Yeah. Get busy. Get busy. Everybody get, get busy. I need y'all to report to the dance floor right this minute. trip doing a house tour and all of this fun stuff but here is the stitch people we have a problem a big problem so you know how i told you about the miracle of like we were completely run out of coolant and somehow luckily we got off the right exit we were still in vegas when we found out so we were able to fill that and not be stranded in the middle of the desert somewhere right well we got here Benji went ahead and took the bus into a shop. They basically said, we have been driving by a miracle. We have no idea how you even pulled the bus into our parking lot. All of the belts are broken. There's pieces like fused together because of the heat. So we're like, uh, there have been angels like holding the belts together or something because we got here, drove for five hours after the coolant incident after Vegas. I have no idea how we're here, but either way, we're here. Bus is in the shop, but here's the problem. We are stranded here and we have to go to Clamor Summit and so we don't, we don't know what we're doing. Ugh. We do have some friends here at Clamor, but the problem is a lot of people do not have a car big enough for our family, right? So I called our friends, uh, Shelly Wallace at Crazy Middles, and they have a bus big enough for our family. Her hubby is on his way here, pick us up and take us to Clamor, maybe back and forth a little bit until we get our bus figured out anyway. They are saving our lives right now, people, but I'm gonna take you on a quick house tour really fast. Now this is a messy house tour because I've been dealing with this all morning, people. I have not been able to keep this house clean and with kids sleeping here last night. It already looks like the not enough now since he has been here. I will take you on a quick messy house tour of our house in Arizona. So here we go. First of all, we walk in and this is like major playroom galore. This is like Ledger and Beckham's favorite place in the world. All these fun dress ups, super cute. So you walk in here. I can't show you my bedroom because people, I haven't even made my bed yet. It's an amazing bathroom, but yeah, look at the mess already. Trying to get ready with this many kids, all my girls in here. Anyway, I need to make my bed, but isn't this room beautiful? It opens up the view, opens up to our beautiful sneak peek of the backyard, but we're gonna show you that in one second. It's got a laundry room with two washers and dryers, which is amazing. There's Benji doing dishes. This is the kitchen. It's so nice, big, huge ceilings. I know, right? And you ask how we have food in the pantry. We do, what do we do? We do Costco delivery. Costco delivery. All right, this is the family room. Cass is reviewing footage on our camera. Oh my gosh, okay, let's do something about pal owners. Okay, somebody help me. So this is the fun family room. My room. You guys have to wait to see the yard. You're gonna die. Wow, you guys are all working hard. You're hardly working. So this is kind of like the teen girls room. 
They have a little walk-in closet. Bathroom, hi Lily. Has another room. This is for like the younger kids. Casey has a blow-up bed. That's my bed and that's my bed. I know, so cute. Super this comfy. is Luke's bed. All right, this yard is amazing. So this is the reason that I am in love with this house. It has been so fun. We've got this full-on kitchen, outdoor kitchen here. The sink, eating area, fire pit area, beautiful pool, all these lounge chairs, and yeah, you're looking what's back there. It's crazy cool. Back here, look at this yard. Oh my gosh, so fun. So it's got this fun play area for the kids and all of these kind of like scoot around toys and they can go all on these roads. How cute is that? All of the fun little houses, they can make deliveries to the houses. So cute, I mean, there's like 10 houses or more. This little putting green, we didn't know, but Paisley's quite the pro at putting already. This is the basketball court back here. And then look at the splash pad! Woo! Isn't this so much fun? If you want more information about this house, maybe I'll add it to the link in the description so that you guys can rent it if you're ever in Arizona. All right, I'm gonna go in, grab our stuff. We gotta go to Clamor, people. This is crazy. I will update you as far as our bus is concerned. Maybe we'll be stranded here for a lot longer than I think. Who knows? Because I don't know how hard it's going to be to fix all of this stuff with the bus. Ooh, that sugar sweet. You got what I need. Sipping on the potion. All that good emotion. Just my kind of heat. Keep it on repeat. Testing by the potion. Love it, this the potion. Cause
guys, so here's the current situation. The kids are out having lunch. We just got a call from the guy. He absolutely cannot figure out our air conditioning. So right now, he said it would take him like weeks to figure out our air conditioning and it would cost us thousands and thousands of dollars. So he said, I could get you running again, but no air conditioning. Yeah, driving in the car, in the bus for seven hours with what, 15 people with no air conditioning in Arizona. Not a good idea. Not a good idea. I got in. We got in. Can you add to like button to switch to us? No. Okay, okay so you guys get that ready. Oh, I trying really hard like we bought this air conditioner right here we plugged it in and for like two minutes it was working and then it like glitched out our electricity probably because it takes too much electricity to run it and so now that doesn't work either so we honestly don't know what we're gonna do maybe we'll wake up like really really early like when it's still dark and drive mostly in the dark anyway as you hear the kids are going crazy time to buckle up and go home and see what we can figure out for morning Bye.